Good morning, dear students. This is Unit 6, Lesson 2 and 3 for Primary 2, Second Term. What can you see in this picture? Yes, birthday cake, that's right. Candles, that's right. Decoration, good. Can you count the, the candles on the cake? How many candles are on the cake? One, two, three, four, five. That's right. Good. So that means they are countable nouns or uncountable nouns. Yes, they are countable nouns because I can count them. I can say one, two, three, and so on. So if you want to ask uh, how many candles or how many things that uh, you can see uh, anywhere, you're going to ask with uh, how many words. Okay, because how many comes with the countable nouns. But if you want to uh, ask about uncountable nouns, they're gonna ask with how much, like how much sugar, how much sugar, how much milk, how much uh, uh, chocolate, and so on. So can you count the decoration? This decoration? Yes, I can count them. How many square, squares, triangles, sorry, how many triangles? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So can you count them? That's right, so they are countable nouns. Okay, what do you eat in the birthday party? Uh, what do you drink and what do you do in the birthday party? If you want to uh, um, invite, what you're, who, who will you gonna invite to your birthday party? Yes, you can eat uh, pizza, uh, sandwiches, cupcakes, the cakes, that's right, chips, that's right. So, what about the uh, drinks? You can drink fizzy drinks, you can drink um, tea, maybe, okay. Uh, lemonade, orange juice, that's right. So, what do you do in the birthday party? Yes, you can dance, sing, and play. Yes, you're gonna invite your family and your friends. Okay, that's good. Now we're gonna read these questions and we will listen to the audio and we're gonna extract the answers from the audio. So listen carefully. The first question is, what does everyone like? What is good for you and what is not good for you? Good for you. How much sugar is there in one ice cream? Can you see how much sugar? Because I, can, I can't count sugar. So I put how much with the uncountable nouns. And also I'm gonna put is because I, uh, I put is with the uncountable nouns. So how much sugar is there in one ice cream? So we're gonna listen and answer these questions. Unit six, lesson two. A, listen and read. Everybody loves ice creams, but are they good for you? There's milk in ice creams and milk is good for you. But there's sugar in ice creams too. Sugar isn't good for you. How much sugar is there in one ice cream? A lot. How many ice creams do you eat in the summer? 10, 20, 30, 40 or 50? Some children eat 60, 70 or 80 ice creams. Some children eat 90 or 100 ice creams. So, what does everyone like? Everyone like ice cream. What is good for you? Is sugar good for you? No, sugar is not good for you. So what is not good for you? Sugar. But what is good for you? Is milk good for you? Yes, that's right. Milk, good for you. Okay, how much sugar is there in one ice cream? A lot, a lot of sugar in one ice cream. So, is ice cream good for you? We said, no, it's not good for you, but the milk inside the ice cream is good for you. But sugar is not good for you. 
And how many ice cream do you eat every day or per week or per month and so on? Per yes, some students or some, uh, uh, some people uh, eat 20, 30, 50, 60 and so on. What about you? Too much, don't eat too much ice cream because it's not healthy for you. You can drink milk. So I'm going to read with you this passage and we will explain each word. Everybody loves ice creams, but are, but are they good for you? There is milk in ice creams and milk is good for you, but there is sugar in ice creams too. Sugar is not good for you. How much sugar is there in one ice cream? A lot of sugar in one ice cream. How many ice creams do you eat in summer? 10, 20, 30, 40, or 50. Some children eat 60, 70, or 80 ice cream. That's too much to eat this number of ice creams. Some children eat 90 or 100 ice creams. So let's answer these questions. Is there milk in ice creams? Yes, there is. It's already done. Okay, is sugar good for you? Yes, it is or no, it is not. No, it is not good for you. Is there a lot of sugar in one ice cream? Yes, there is. Uh, please, if you want to answer the short answer of any question, you must look at the beginning of the question. If it starts with is, you're gonna put is. No, it isn't. Uh, and look here, if you're talking about the sugar, so I will put it with the sugar. Because I saw a lot of students didn't do like that. So this is the ice cream, milk, and sugar. Can you see the sugar cubes? Can you see the sugar cubes? Okay, can you count them or not? Yes, I can count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. So six sugar cubes. So the sugar cubes are countable nouns because I can count them. But can you count the sugar itself? No, I can count them. So sugar is uncountable now. So if you want to ask uh, about the uh, sugar cubes, you're going to say how many sugar cubes do you want? But if you want to ask about the sugar like that, you're going to say how much sugar do you want? And it's also about the milk. Can you count the milk itself? No, I can count the milk because it's uncountable now. But can you count the, the bottle of the milk? Yes, I can count the bottle of how many bottles of the milk? Just one. So it's on uh, it's countable it's an, an it's an countable noun. It's a countable noun. It's my brother's birthday party. Let's choose the food we want. Someone said I want chips and someone said I like pizza. Uh, my brother wants a cake with jam. And he likes fizzy drinks too. This is fizzy drinks. Is fizzy uh, or fizzy drinks good for you? No, it's not good for you. What about the jam? Can you count the jam inside the jar? Can you count the jam? No, you can't count them, but you can count the jar of the jam. So how many jars of jam here? Just one. That's good. Can you? read this passage i'm gonna read it with you so follow me and follow by your reading thing uh, by your eyes and try to read with me after or after me hi sandy how are you i'm fine so you are having a party here are some ideas for party food and drinks pizza is great food for a party Sandwiches and chips are also good. I like fizzy drinks, but my sister doesn't like them. The birthday cake must be big. My brother loves cake. Mom makes a chocolate cake with jam. Do you like chocolate cakes with jam? For him every Saturday. There are sweets on it too. Can you see the sweets? On the birthday cake 
Finally, have a great party. Send me some photos. This is a message from Ben to Sandy. This is a message or an email from Sandy. Hi, sorry, for Sandy from Ben. Hi, Sandy. And at the end of the message, the name of the sender. So he is Ben. Is Ben fine? Yes, this is already done. Who is having a party? Yes, Sandy. Does, does Ben's sister like fizzy drinks? No, she doesn't. What does Ben's brother love? Chocolate cake with jam. What's on the cake? There are sweets on it. So we have a text box full of words. You're going to extract the word and put it in its correct place. We have fizzy drink, sugar, chips, jam, ice cream, 50, pizza. The first question is, I have a packet of to eat after lunch. A packet of fizzy drink, sugar, chips, jam, ice cream, 50 or pizza. Chips. We put the chips in packets. So I have a packet of chips to eat after lunch. Can I have some chocolate what please? Chocolate fizzy drink, cho chocolate sugar, chocolate jam, or chocolate ice cream, ice cream. So can I have some chocolate ice cream please? I have what pounds in my pocket? How many pounds in my pocket? Can I say? Uh, Jam pounds? No, 50 pounds in my bucket. How many spoons of, of what do you take in your coffee? Why I said how many spoons of sugar? I'm going to put here sugar, spoons of sugar. Do you take in your coffee? I put sugar in the coffee. So why I said here how many spoons of sugar? Because if you put the sugar in the spoon, that you can count how many spoons of sugar. So we said how many comes with the countable nouns and I can count the spoons of sugar. Pepsi is my favorite what? Pepsi is my favorite fizzy drink. What about you? Do you like Pepsi or, Co uh, or uh, Fanta or what? Would you like a slice of? Would you like a slice of pizza? So I put slice before pizza to count how many uh, slices of pizza do you have. Here are the, uh, the answers, chips, ice cream, 50, sugar, fizzy drink and pizza.